What actually causes Hashimoto's? You may have seen the recent Nobel Prize awarded to several researchers that discovered the role of regulatory T cells with the immune system. And the best that they know so far is that the regulatory T cells have some type of a role to play in making it so that you start attacking your own tissue instead of you know attacking anything that could be potentially a like a foreign invader, foreign pathogen, or something else that you need to have your body protected from. And so with the immune system, it will start attacking things to protect you. And there's some dysfunction that happens, and there tends to be some type of a genetic tendency for it for certain people that makes it so that your body starts attacking yourself, in this case, the thyroid gland at the base of your neck that produces, of course, your thyroid hormone. And so the immune system becomes confused essentially about what is self and what is not self, and it starts attacking your own tissues. Its perception is that it's protecting you somehow. Um, really the root of that is most likely going to be related to the cells of your body and how well they're functioning and if they feel supported properly or not. And they found that if we support specific types of processes in our immune system related to the vitamin D receptors, that if we support them properly and help them to work the way they need to, that we can even basically put our autoimmune conditions into more of a state of remission. And some people would say cure, and which terminology you prefer doesn't matter, except, of course, that we feel better is what matters. <laughs> and so if we support those vitamin D receptors properly, through nutrition and diet and lifestyle, usually a combination of all of those, then we can often get that to go back into a state of remission. And that's what we do is we help to figure out where your cells compromise, what can we do to support them. And our goal would be that long term, you help the immune system have optimal function and no longer feel threatened in a way that then triggers the autoimmune reactions.